Good morning, good morning, good morning, and happy Wednesday. I, pray, I mean, Thursday, goodness gracious, happy Thursday. I pray that everybody is doing well and being blessed. Anyway, I had something I wanted to share with you very quickly this morning. Um, I just got off of a call with a personal trainer. This is something that I've been considering doing for quite some time now. Um, I feel like I've just kind of hit a plateau um, in terms of my fitness and my weight goals. Um, I just have a certain number at this point that no matter what I do, it just won't budge. Um, and I've shared some of the things that I've done on the channel. I have um, increased calories. I have decreased calories. I've had dairy. I've removed dairy. I've had our artificial sweetener. I've removed artificial sweetener. I've had low carb. I've had extremely low carb. I've done no carb, <laughs> basically uh, carnivore. And it's like, no matter what I do, I'm just not, I feel like I'm not making progress or as much progress as I would like to make at this point. Um, and so one of the things that I feel like it's time to do is time to push myself more uh, as it relates to the fitness part of things. Now, I've been working out for uh, several years now, um, and I think I just need an extra push. I need to focus more on weights. One of the things that I realize is that I am very prone to to um, injury and I keep hurting myself in the same places over and over again. So I don't know if my form is just off because I have no clue what I'm doing. I'm just kind of just doing stuff, right? Um, and so I think at this point, I just really need um, just an extra push, somebody to really push me um, in the gym. And so um, I just got off of a call with a personal trainer here locally um, that was at six o'clock, um, just to go over what my goals are, what I desire to see, um, and costs, you know, as well. Uh, because one of the things that he says, and it's so true, is that a personal trainer is not a necessity. It is a luxury, right? That is not something that, um, that everybody can do. And I had to make sure that that would fit, um, because I want to make sure that I'm being careful in terms of my finances as well, especially in today's economy. And that's a whole other conversation. So um, so just got off my call with him. I think more than likely it is something that I am going to do, something that I'm going to invest in because I've always said what, from the beginning when I started my weight loss journey that I don't desire just to be smaller, right? I want to be fit. My desire is not to be little. It's not to be skinny, right? I don't want to be skinny fat. I want to be fit. I want to be healthy. I want to um, decrease my, um, increase my muscle mass, decrease uh, the body fat percentage. And so, um, you know, so we're just ready to go to the next level. So more than likely we'll get started with that on next week. So what about you? Do you have a personal trainer? What kind of workouts do you do? Do you work out at home? Do you work out in a gym? Uh, I am a member of the YMCA, um, but during the colder months, since I like to work out in the morning, it would just be absolutely freezing in the morning. So I did more of my workouts at home. As it warms up, um, we'll start to go back to the gym more, but I'm going to incorporate this personal training um, into that routine as well. So, you know, just interested to see how that unfolds. So my birthday is in July and let's see what it is. It's March right now. I'm trying to be right by my 50th birthday. <laughs> oh, I, and yeah, I know people hate when people say that they want to do certain things for a certain date or a certain occasion. And really, I'm not that person. Y'all have been doing this since 2010. It is a journey, right? Not a destination. But still, I want to be looking good on my 50th birthday. So let's get it. Anyway, I pray that everybody has a wonderful and blessed day. And we will talk to you soon. Peace out, y'all.